Yeah, welcome to my channel, Tech Media. My name is Walter Devega, and I want to welcome each and every one of you. If you are a returning subscriber, I want to thank you to always taking your time, watching our content, and liking, and also sharing our content. Thank you so much. And if by any way you come go on this um on content. I want to say thank you. This channel is going to be is going to be bless you with several knowledge. Please hit the subscribe button and the like button because there are a lot of content we are sharing here. Not only um, church media content, we also have some tech content too that we'll be sharing with you here. Um, without much ado, I'll let us dive into the tutorial. So today we'll be talking about uh, the Bible show, uh, that is the alternative um, Bible presentation software. Uh, but this time around, we want to talk about the Bible show. Um, the Bible show is a little bit lighter than the Easy Worship. Yes, it's a little bit lighter than Easy Worship because the only thing you're going to be doing here in Bible show is just the Bible. Yes, this is the interface. This is the interface. The only thing you'll be doing here is just punch in the Bible reference and then boom, goes to life. Depends on um, whatever presentation you want to use this for. Right, so, but majorly strictly for Bible presentation. So you can add lyrics in this. Yeah, you can add lyrics. So, but if you need any other, if you need any other thing aside does the Bible? You can always make use of the uh, easy worship. Okay, so but another uh, advantages of this Bible show, aside the fact that you can do, um, aside the fact that it's light, you can also do several Bible versions. Yes, so I'm going to be showing us how to get it downloaded. You can just click on the link below this video link download that will take you to the download page where you download the full version and guess what it comes free free yeah free but um most important thing is that you just need to have the understanding of how to use this software so when you download it and install the first page land to your face is this this is how the interface looks like. This is how the interface looks like. Okay, so you can always rearrange the every bar there. You can always rearrange it to suit your um uh, your desire output. Okay, so for every bar you have here, for every bar you have here, it serves a purpose. For every bar you have it has a purpose. For instance, if you click on this reference, you see that one of the boxes will appear, right? So, and in this box, you have where that is where you have your Bible versions, okay? And here you have the books, right? Then here is where you have the chapter and verse. Then here you have the references. If you click on this browser, it disappeared the box of the uh, all the Bible verse, all the books verses, right? So then you have control. Anyone you click, you're going to see it on the screen. Option, see that's what the option is. program. See that's what the program is. Search, that's what it is. So your first opening after installing this Bible show, this is how it looks like. Yeah, it's uh, she's hearing the sound the background. It's raining here, and uh, uh, so um, first thing first, you want to set your team. You want to set your team, and these are different teams here. I downloaded several teams here. So, and if you want more team, you can always click on this button here. Let me show you. 
yeah yeah this so you can always click that to have other okay if you click inside you have different theme of lower top so anyone you want you click and if you need more you just click on download so you have several ones that will display here so once you click on download from the browser box you have different theme display so all you just need to do is click on download and install but if you are not if you don't like this you can always select another team so for every team you select it shows you how it looks like let's click on the nine say it shows you how it looks like. let me install this yes. so once you install it you will have it here display so display here and you can see it from this plugin it's installing you can see this bar loading so that's a sign that it's installing so okay i think we have it here now we have it we have it already added so you can always select different team you can always select different team so once you have your desire once you find your desired team you just click on download and install that's all then from this monitor is where you're going to have um the preview of what you have on your live um, section so if you click on this book let's say you can play you have it display here so that's for the lower touch should in case you want to use for um live stream let's say youtube okay youtube or any other uh, live stream platform so you can always have the video behind right you have the video behind then you have the um bible display underneath the feed. so that's what call you have and you can always change the lower top and change to another one change for different right? and if you want it to be the full screen click on the full screen thing you see click on the full screen thing on the full screen. so anyone you selected there is what you will have as a display output either to your auditorium or to your youtube facebook instagram depends on the uh, platform you want to stream to okay then another thing we'll be talking about under this uh, reference part is when, um, let's say, you are asked to bring uh, to display Genesis, Genesis 1 or Genesis 2 something, right? So all you just need to do first is you come to this reference display. So if you come to this reference and you were asked to display genesis 3 just the first two letters so it's display genesis already so come to this chapter you see genesis 2 then tap verse 3 or 5 then press enter then press enter again the moment you press enter twice you have a display and if the um, the pastor changed the Bible verse or to another book. He said, maybe for Samuel, one S. See? Four. Chapter four, verse six. Press enter twice. One, two. Display. The same thing apply if you are having, and this goes for a uh, live stream, probably for your youtube or facebook depends on the platform you are streaming to. and if you want it to be a full screen as well you just change the thing full screen then for every verses you want to be displaying right you just click on this play button play button ok 
okay so you can always change another thing it depends on what you feel like okay so but i like using this lower top because i do use it for live stream okay so that is for here and this is the monitor which reveal to you what you have to display then if you come to this configuration in this configuration this it will tell you where you want to send your output to do you want if you have a projector connected to this system it will tell you um monitor two you get so this is monitor one which is my primary monitor that i'm using to do this on video and if it is monitor two or you have three monitors it will display here and this is display one monitor one is one so you see monitor two just select whichever one you want to display out meanwhile from here you see destination you see display window have this then ndi that is for your lower third that is for your lower third probably you want to pick your output via ndi so the bible show actually enable ndi so you have ndi and if you have data files that's um, prices of all the um, messages right so and um you can come to do display two and select the source of what you want to display bible or you want to display just display but we don't need you don't need this all we all you need this for is probably you are connected to um another screen your projector and you want to send this to the second screen more like on um, having to um dividing your screen right so you can just drag this to the next screen but if you have it set this way no so the system here automatically decide where you are sending it to because you already have your window display and your ndi set up here right then if you come to reference here you can adjust the color and where you want the bible reference to show which is this one and always adjust it then if you come to the bible here too as well you click on the bible you can add more bible version you can add more bible version to anyone you want probably the ones that are not installed you can just click on install then it will be added to your reference box here to be added to it there so um let me just this one is the first one for all this let me just click on all this so if you click on update you see it downloading here you can see at the bottom so it means there is always update so if there is any update on any of on the version you downloaded you will have it here requesting you to update okay so um you click on the history okay you click on the history this history button will actually bring back this is to tell you the bible verses you have presented or your bible your, your pastor requested so you can always just click on this once you click on it it takes you to where it is exactly then you just click on play just like you click on the first one then you click on maybe Jeremiah yeah that's Jeremiah so you click on it it's display live double click it's display live double click on the first one here it's display live so the the, the bible should actually make your presentation easier okay let's make your presentation easier i'll be leaving the download link for this bible show so you can always um download the full version the full 
crash because there are several um, link on Google that are not um, uh, genuine, right? So if you just check the description below this video, you can always um, click on it and then get it downloaded. So um, Bible Show does not do songs, lyric songs. No, it does not do that and does not do um powerpoints or any of that all all it does is um the bible presentation That's, there are several um bible presentation software but, but then i would recommend bible show it's nice it's, it's cool so you can and you can always have different version of all books too as well <laughs> Um, we are not only presenting in church media softwares, we also do tech, like um, network security and so, several other things. So you can also contact us. Maybe you want us to you know, do a training for your media. You can always um, do that too as well. So thank you for your time. Thank you so much for always checking out on our contents to see and also to upgrade yourself. Thank you. We love you. Always stay blessed. Bye.